What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, capsule, side, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free, free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 05. Um, thanks for all the new subscribers. If you'd look, like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. Most of them are filled up, but I do have some slots available. You have to text me to book, and I have a new service called uh, Life Coaching if anybody's interested. Okay, so trigger warning for this one. If you get triggered, you need to click off. Please click off. It is very triggering. I don't want anybody triggered, and if you get triggered, please click off, okay? It's regarding children and sexual abuse, okay? Okay. So the channel message I received was children have been blackmailed by very immature adult energies strategically trying to hide sexual abuse of these kids strategically for strategic reasons. They have black they I not blackmailed them. They have threatened the children to be quiet about the sexual abuse being done to them. But through many series of chain of events, a lot of these children are about to break free and they're about to speak on the sexual abuse to somebody they don't want um, the, uh, the pedophile abusers, basically, to speak on it to. And it's going to create series of chain of events um, negatively for the pedophile abusers. That's what I heard. Well, that's what you get, pedophile abusers, for touching children in inappropriate areas and places. And, you know, quit. Hashtag save the kids. And I'm just being for real. I don't know if this is molestation. I don't know if this is child porn. I don't know if this is underage uh, prostitution rings. I don't know if this is um, what this is. But it's something. It could be a mixture. It could be a mixture. It could be molestation, child porn. Uh, underage child prostitution rings, it could, it, it, whatever it is, it's something to do inappropriately with children, whatever the hell it is, the children, I heard the children have been basically bullied by the abuser adults to not say anything, and I heard they haven't, they haven't said anything, probably because they were scared as hell, I think some of these people are probably their parent or guardians, they most certainly are, it's about to backfire a lot of these people in a huge way. Confirmation. I heard they most certainly are. So a lot of these so-called adults that have guardianship or rights, parental rights in some shape, form, or fashion, or guardian rights or something to these children, they bullied their these children not to say anything for their selfish gain. And they're either inappropriately touching them or did, like molestation or some kind of child porn videos or child prostitution or ch child pedophile ring or something. It's disgusting. But I heard many of these children are about to break free and they're about to tell um, somebody that actually cares about them and will do something. Um, it's about to be someone they would have never, do not want them to know. They know if they tell this person, they're going to take uh, action and they will. Okay, I heard it's going to backfire on these immature adults because they're immature is what they are. They're immature as hell. Stay the hell away from kids, man. Go make your money in a correct manner if anybody needs to hear that. Um, if you're making money off kids. For some, it could have just been molestation. Um, but it's still not okay. It's still not okay. But whether these people may... There's a reason they bullied these kids. Probably because they didn't want their rights taken away. Their parental rights taken away. Or they were using and exploiting them and making money off of them. Or they didn't want to be put in jail for um, molestation or rape or something. For some of these situations, it could have been rape. But I heard a lot of these kids are about to break away and tell somebody they know will help. And I will tell you, yes, counselors are mandatory reporters. Nurses are mandatory reporters. Law enforcement is mandatory reporters. Legals mandatory reporting. But these people had to be upright. You had to be an upright. I mean, oh, some of these people, even though they wear the hat in the community, trust me, I know my community, just saying, doesn't mean 
they actually do their job and they mandatory report. That's, I mean, I'm a nurse. I've been a nurse for a long time. I'm RN, y'all know that. But that's one reason I'm happy not being a nurse out in my community. Because I've seen too many dirty nurses cover up shit. You wear the hat, you need to wear it well. And that's just the truth. I've seen too many dirty cops, too many dirty counselors, too many dirty situations in my city. You wear the hat, you need to wear it well. And that's just the truth. But I heard a lot of these kids are about to break away and tell somebody they know will, will actually do something about it. Someone that these immature assholes that are making money off them with Social Security benefits or illegal behind the scenes pay to play schemes or whatever, whatever, they will take some action. And apparently there is no um, statute of limitations for sexual abuse. I didn't know that until today when I watched Vision Goddess Tarot's video, but that's good. There For any, anybody that doesn't know, this is good information. There is no statute of limitations for sexual abuse. So if there's some kind of sexual abuse situation, there's no statute of limitations. And if you guys don't know what statute of limitations is, please Google it, okay? It's very important. There is no statute of limitations for sexual abuse. And that is very important in these situations with these kids because especially if you are upright parent and you don't have full custody or no custody or... And, and the people have been strategically hiding the abuse and they've been bullying these kids to keep it from you and it gets out to you, you can use that, is what I'm saying. If anybody needs to hear that. I'm going to pull a card and then I'll close it. Spirit message this year, I have to close it. Ebb and flow and compassion. I think these kids, um, I heard the kids are about to break a lot of these kids. They're about to, they have been bullied not to say anything, not to say anything. Keep their mouth shut. Keep the, keep your damn mouth shut was the exact words for some of these kids. Oh, that's so freaking sickening. Keep your damn mouth shut was the exact word for some of these kids. How unsympathetic is that? You're a damn parent of these kids and you threaten them by saying, quote, unquote, keep your damn mouth shut? No. Don't, I mean, you're supposed to be 18 plus watching these videos, but if somebody needs to hear this, don't keep your mouth shut. If anybody needs to hear this, okay? Ebb and flow and compassion. Very light side individuals are about to get unexpected phone calls soon. Very unexpected phone calls, unexpected text messages, unexpected emails, unexpected visitors at their home. It is about, the, it is about to get topsy-turvy regarding children. Oh, my Lord of mercy. Okay, so very light side individuals. So you treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. You don't abuse kids. You don't molest kids, touch kids inappropriately. You don't put them in child pay-to-play schemes or pedophile rings or exploit or abuse them or place hidden voyeur cameras in people's homes to exploit people's kids or whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, you actually love kids, I'm presuming. Um, or you care for kids. You don't want to abuse or exploit them is what I'm saying. Um, you're about to start, some of you guys, you're about to start getting I heard, ex unexpected phone calls, unexpected visitors to your home, um, unexpected um, text messages, unexpected um, communication, emails. I mean, communication all over the place um, from kids and adults, light side adults. They care from kids and un and light side adults that care. So you're about to get topsy turvy energy coming. The kids are about to start speaking. Whether these assholes want them to speak or not, they're about to start speaking. I think these kids are so miserable that they 
they feel the need to speak it out is what I feel. And they should. Nobody should be bullied, harass, harassed, and threatened, especially kids. But the reason these assholes, immature adult assholes are doing it because they don't want to get caught. But they shouldn't have been doing it to begin with. And that's just the truth. So, light side individuals, you're about to start getting, it's about to cause topsy-turvy energy. There are uh, kids, some, some of these kids are about to speak on it. They're about to speak on it and thank God. Um, if my kid, if my kids are, um, if this has happened to my kids, I hope they speak out to me. I'm just saying. If this has happened to my kids, I really hope they speak out to me. And I'm just being serious. Or to, or to somebody. Hopefully me, because I'll, I'll do something about it. But, um, and they know I will. And my ex-husband knows I will, too. But anyway, so, um, so yeah, um, topsy-turvy energy, the ebb and flow, topsy-turvy energy, compassion. Um, I think Blyside individuals, you're about to have compassion. I heard you want to help these kids. Some of these kids are about to, um, they're about to communicate to you. Please do something about it. Please do something about it. Don't be these dirty, upright, thinking they're upright in their community, but they're really not just because they wear the hat. Oh, I'm a counselor. I'm a mandatory reporter, but yet I, I cover up incest and rape and molestation. No, no. Oh, I'm a nurse, but I cover up blah, 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 blah. No, no. Oh, I'm a police officer, but really I'm a dirty police officer and I sell drugs behind the scenes. No, no. Upright here, upright. But I heard it's about to start, um, it's about to start happening. It's about to start happening quick. Um, I think you're, upright individuals, if you're about to start receiving this communication from these kids or somebody else, you're about to have a lot of compassion from the situ for the situation. This is the topsy-turvy energy, the up and down topsy-turvy energy. Uh, unexpected, I heard, unexpected phone calls, texts, emails, people coming at your door. Um, I don't like that. I like people to call before they come, but in this situation might be an emergency situation. If it's an emergency situation to get kids out of abusive situations, I don't mind that. But anything else, I do. And that's just the truth. These people cannot hide it anymore. People are about to end up in jail. And some are not going to get out. And they think they will. Oh, my God. I heard it's, uh, okay, so some of these, it's going to create a series of chain of events. And some of these people are end up in jail. And they should. They should. Um, and I heard some of these people aren't going to get out. And they think they're going to. So, they're going to end up in jail. But, and they think they're going to be able to bond out or bail out, I'm presuming. But they're not. I'll pull a tipper. I mean, damn, this is, yikes. You shouldn't be touching kids inappropriately. You shouldn't be um, doing pay-to-play schemes, pedophile rings, uh, whatever, whatever, whatever. I think some of these situations include rape, too, and I'm just being serious. I didn't hear that. I just intuitively feel it. Heard it's about to happen soon. This is futuristic energy, but soon future, futuristic energy. I think life side individual, you're about to have lots of compassion for this situation. I think you're going to take some action. And please, God, do. Please do. Spirit messages here. Thank you. Okay, I'm not going to take them. Unexpected uh, expectation reversed. Number 36 can be very significant number in one's life. Number 36. It is time to speak up and speak it proud. Some of these kids are so embarrassed, but that is not their fault. It is the immature. Adults that put them in this situation to begin with. Okay, I heard these kids are so, some of these kids are so embarrassed. But 
My heart is not their fault. And it's not their fault. It's not the kid's fault. It's not. It's the immature, greedy ass adults that put themselves in this situation. And that's just and that's the truth. If the immature, greedy adults watch my channel. All right, I'm getting out of this. I love you guys so much, and I will say.